George, a real competitive game, a real good game. What was it like to play in? Yeah, it's quite fast game, quite tough game to play in. Um, but we knew that coming into it and we knew what to expect. And a game of very few chances, unfortunately, we couldn't put one away. Feel like a point game, though? Yeah, of course, you know, against these big teams you come up against, you know, first thought is just not to lose. And, you know, we kept solid at the back. And, um, you know, I thought, I thought we limited to them, them to very few chances. And, you know, if we could have nicked a goal, I feel like it would have, you know, finished 1-0. But, you know, unfortunately it didn't. Yeah, it did feel like a game on a knife edge and one goal would win it. Just after half time, had a really good spell. Did you think at that point you might, uh, you might nick one? <laughs> yeah, I felt like something might come. But obviously at the end, you know, we didn't, we didn't finish our chances. But we kept on creating and kept on trying. But unfortunately, it just wasn't enough today. As you say, the key is if you can't win, don't lose. And another clean sheet from that new look back three, you must be chuffed. Yeah, well, obviously it's, um, you know, great performances from Will and Owen and, you know, I'm just happy to play alongside them and, you know, I know what they can provide for the team, the two solid lads and, um, yeah, we just gave everything to keep the clean sheet today and, you know, trafted well behind us as well. Absolutely. I mean, I know we'll be looking forward to having Geth and Rico back, but once upon a time, if we'd known those two were going to be out, we would have thought, well, we're going to cope, but you, you've done admirably, the three of you. You must be pleased that you've very quickly come together as a unit. Yeah, well, they've slotted in perfectly and, you know, that's, that's the way we want it, you know, two competitive players in each position in the squad and you know it just drives each other every day every day in training in each games and you know they've done, done themselves no harm coming into the side and they've done really well Obviously, and yourself you finished as skipper today is that a nice touch I know uh, there's a couple of players missing but you took the armband that's a nice reflection of, of what you bring to your team yeah of course it's something I want to develop on you know my leadership skills it's not always easy you know in the midst of the match and the heat you know to be the calm head amongst mm. amongst the team but you know it's something I want to develop and yeah I'm happy to, uh, that Kieran gave me the armband mm. I know we've got a tough run of games coming up a big run of games that's not a bad way to start it because they're probably not going to be far away when push comes to shove yeah well I think it will give us a bit of confidence going into the next games you know we can compete with these big teams around us and you know if we if we want to you know be where we want to be at the end of the season these are the teams we've got to beat to get there what was it like just lastly playing in front of the crowd today 25,000 plus biggest crowd here for 10 years it shows that uh, you're doing something right yeah well plaudits to the fans you know um, if we're doing something right then they're going to want to come and watch us and you know if we keep putting on good performances good displays and hopefully we can reach the numbers again you know, it'll be not quite as many but plenty will travel the next two games two away games now on the road at Lincoln and Barnsley keep chipping away and keep adding to the points tally yeah two big games two completely different games but we know what we're going to come up against and you know we know what to expect and we'll go into them with a lot of confidence